Hi everyone, uh, welcome back to my channel, GTR Math Tutorial. So for today's video, uh, we will discuss uh, integrals involving inverse trigonometric functions. Okay, so we have three uh, formulas. Well, so we have the, uh, three direct formulas for this integral, integral of du over square root of a squared minus u squared. Uh, a here is constant, so square root of a squared minus u squared equals arc sine u over a plus c. Then we have integral of du over a squared plus u squared equals 1 over a times arc tangent u over a plus c. And then last, integral of du over u times square root of u squared minus a squared. So that is equal to 1 over a times arc second u over a plus c. Okay, so that's our uh, three formulas uh, that leads to uh, inverse trigonometric functions arc sine, arc tan, and arc second. Okay, so I have uh, five examples. Okay, uh, please take a screenshot first and then try to answer before watching my solution. Okay, so let's start. Uh, number one. Okay, so for number one, we have integral of dx over 9 minus x squared. So which of the three formulas that uh, we are going to use? So, 9 here is the a squared, the constant. Okay, so therefore we will use this formula du over square root of a squared minus u squared. So that is equal to arc sine u over a plus c. So in this uh, given, so we have our 9 here uh, is the a squared. So a squared is equal to 9. So get the square root. So therefore a is equal to square root of 9. So that is equal to 3. And then our u is x squared, so therefore we have u squared is equal to x squared, and therefore u is equal to equal to x. And then of course the derivative of u is dx. So therefore, uh, by substitution or by uh, using this uh, formula, so we have direct formula. Just substitute uh three three for a and then x for for u for this uh, u squared. So therefore we have direct formula. The answer to this is arc sine u over a, the value of u is x. So x, arc sine x over, the value of a is 3. So x over 3 plus c. So final answer. Okay, so next number, number 2. So we have integral of dy over 25 plus 9y squared. So obviously this is uh, number 2 because uh, only tangent is uh, positive. So for arc sine and arc second, the formula is uh, minus a squared minus u squared and then u squared minus a squared for arc second. So the only positive is the arc tangent and then it doesn't have a square root. Okay, so our u here is or our u squared here is the variable. So we have 9y squared. So therefore, our u is equal to the square root, square root of 9, uh, square root both sides. Just take the positive. So square root of 9, we have 3. Square root of y squared is y. Okay, so our u is 3y. And then our a squared is equal to 25. So a squared is equal to 25. And then get the square root. So therefore, a is equal to square root of 25. That is equal to 5. And then get the derivative of this or differential. u is equal to 3y. Therefore, the du is equal to differentiate 3y. So that is equal to 3dy. So in our uh, given, we have integral of dy and then over 25 plus 9y squared. So by substitution, we have du equals 3dy. So therefore, we're going to have a neutralizing factor. So we have neutralizing factor of uh, reciprocal of 3. So we have one third. So our integral is now equal to, so by substitution, so we have integral of, we have 25 will become uh, our, uh, that is 5 squared. Okay, so 5 squared plus, so 9y squared. So that is equal to, uh, this can be written as 3y squared. And then our uh, dy is equal to du over 3. Or we can uh, write this as we have uh, du is equal to 3dy. So we put 3dy here and then, neutralizing factor of one third okay so that it is in the form so it is now in the form uh one third 
integral of du over, this is the a squared plus u squared. Okay, so therefore we can use this uh, direct formula. Okay, so the answer will be 1 over a, the value of a is 5. So we have 1 over a, so 1 over a is 5, so 1 over 5 times, uh, we have 1 third outside, so ju just write 1 third, and then we have arc tangent u over a, so arc tangent u over a so the value of u is 3y and then the value of a is 5 so therefore we have arctan 3y over 5 plus c so just simplify uh, combine this or multiply this 1 fifth times 1 third we have 1 over 15 arctan arctangent 3y over 5 plus c so this is the final answer okay so next number number 3 so we have a square root of dx over 2x times square root of 4x squared minus 1. So it is in the form uh, the last the last uh, integral. So du over u times u squared minus a squared. Okay, so our u squared here is the 4x squared. So u squared is equal to 4x squared. And then get the square root. So therefore u is equal to square root of 4 so we have 2 square root of x squared is 2 is x then get the differential of this so du is equal to 2 dx so again we don't have 2 in the in the numerator so therefore we have neutralizing factor of 1 half okay so 1 half so our a here is is 1 so a squared is equal to so this is 1 so 1 and then get the square root so therefore a is equal to 1 Okay, so this is now equal to, so the neutralizing factor, 1 half, and then integral of, we have 2 dx, okay, so 2 dx over 2x times a square root of 4x squared, so that uh, can be written as 2x, 2x, how are you, 2x squared minus 1, 1 square, okay, so which is now in the form du over this is the u and then u squared minus a squared okay so just uh, apply this directly so we have one half so therefore uh, one half times one over a the value of a is one okay the value of a is one so that is one over one or we can uh it's okay if, if we do not write this okay so one over one and then times the arc second arc second u over a. So our u is 2x and our a is 1. So therefore, arc second, so we can just uh, write a 2x. So 2x over 1 plus c. And then just simplify. So therefore, we have 1 half times 1. So we have 1 half arc second 2x plus c. So this is the final answer. Okay, so next number, number 4. So we have integral of dy over 1 plus y Plus, uh, 1 plus y times the square root of y. So obviously, the only applicable integral or formula for this is the arc tangent because the sign is the sign is positive. Okay? So how are we going to use this? So we can express, uh, we must express the integrand into the form a squared plus u squared. So obviously our a square is is one, and then our u square is. I uh, take note that uh y can be written as a square root of y, and then square. So we can cancel if we cancel the square root and square, so that is equal to y. So we will write this y as a square root of y square. Okay. So therefore it's equal to integral of dy over. So 1, so that can be written as 1 square, plus y can be written as a square root of y, and then square. And then multiply that by a square root of y. And then we will use a substitution for this. Okay, so let's see if we can uh, transform that into this form. So if, if we will let u is equal, u here is equal to a square root of y. Okay, so this is our u, square root of y. Our a is the is 1. a is equal to 1. So let's get the differential of this. 
So we have du is equal to, we have direct formula for uh, square root of y. The derivative of square root of y is 1 over 2 square root of y times derivative of y, times derivative of y, or we can put the dy here in the numerator. So the direct formula for du is equal to dy over 2 square root of y. So therefore, so this is now equal to, by substitution, so this is equal to dy over 2 square root of y. dy over, we have dy over square root of y. So this term, this term, dy over square root of y. So that is this term and the, we, we don't have 2. So we're going to put 2 in the, in the new in the denominator and then we will multiply it by 2 so we can write the write this as 2 and then dy over okay so dy over uh 1 squared plus square root of y squared and then we can multiply that by 2 square root of y okay so it is now in the form uh, it's now in the form du or integral of du over a squared plus u squared. So this is our a square. This is our uh, u square. And then dy over 2 square root of y. And that is our du. Okay, so it's now in the form uh, 2 integral of dy over dy over 2 square root of u. So that is our du over so 1 squared. So that is our a. So it's in the form a squared plus Square root of y is our u, so a squared plus u squared. So we just have neutralizing factor of 2. Okay, so therefore apply this, apply the formula. So the answer is now equal to 2 times 1 over a. 1 over a, what is our a? The value of a is 1, so 1 over 1. And then we have arctangent, arctangent u over a. So u is square root of y over the value of a is 1, so plus c. So just uh, let's just uh, ignore this 1 since 2 times 1 is still uh, 2. So we have 2 arctan and then square root of y over 1 is square root of y plus c. So this will be our final answer, 2 times arctangent square root of y plus c, just by simple uh, substitution. Okay, so last number, number 5. We have integral of e to the x dx over square root of 1 minus e to the 2x. Okay, so which of the formula are we going to use? So the first term is constant minus a function of x. So obviously this is arc sine. So we will use this. So we can write this as integral of e to the x dx and then we have square root of 1 can be written as 1 1 square minus e to the 2x. So that is that can be written as e to the x and then square. Okay, e to the 2x. So that's the same as e to the x and then square. So now our u here will be e to the x. And then our a is equal to square, uh, square root of 1. So this is our a, 1. And then get the derivative or du Differential du is equal to differential of e to the x is e to the x dx. Okay, so it is now in the form by substitution e to the x dx that is du over square root of 1 square. So that is that is our a. So a squared minus e to the x. e to the x is our u. So minus u square. So it is now in the form integral of du over square root of a squared minus u squared. So just uh, apply the formula. So the answer will be arc sine u over a. So we have arc sine u over a. The value of u is e to the x. The value of u is e to the x. Uh, e to the x over the over a. The value of a is uh, just 1. So no need to write that 1 plus c. So final answer will be arc sine e to the x plus the constant of integration c okay so that's it i hope uh, you learned something from this uh, video thank you for watching and see you on uh, our next uh, tutorial on integral calculus bye bye and god bless